UI Nexus 6P USB-C Board Vibrator and Loudspeaker Repair. Warning, you are performing this repair at your own risk. We claim no responsibility for any damages that might occur. To perform this DIY repair, you will need a plastic triangle opening tool, nylon spudger, SIM card ejection tool, fine tip curve tweezers, precision knife set, multi-purpose heat gun, professional Phillips screwdriver, playing cards, power down the Huawei Nexus 6P smartphone, Eject the Nexus 6P Nano SIM card tray. Apply heat to the plastic panel located at the bottom of the Google phone. Insert the precision knife underneath the plastic panel and create enough space to fit a playing card. Work the playing card under the plastic panel and remove it from the Nexus 6P. Apply additional heat as needed. Now turn your attention to the tight-fitting glass panel at the top of the Google phone. Apply heat and then with the precision knife create enough space to fit a playing card. Carefully slide the playing card under the glass panel and peel it off. Apply additional heat as needed. With the fine tip curved tweezers, remove the two tamper evident seals. Remove the following six Phillips screws. Use the precision knife to create space and insert a plastic triangle opening tool. Use the triangle opening tool to release the clips and pop the Nexus 6P out of its rear enclosure. Remove the falling Phillips screw and then the metal bracket. Disconnect and remove the daughter board interconnect cable. Detach the battery connector from the Nexus 6P motherboard. 
Disconnect the signal cable from the USB-C daughter board. Remove the following screw securing the Nexus 6P USB-C board in place. Use the spudger to pry up and remove the USB-C board from the Google phone. With the fine tip curve tweezers, remove the vibrating motor. Remove the falling Phillips screw. Use the tweezers to peel up the spring contacts and remove the Nexus 6P loudspeaker from the phone. All the replacement parts and repair tools used in the video are available at www.fixeasy.com. Make sure to take a look at our other DIY smartphone and tablet repair tutorials. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter.